I have a YouTube video that I shot a few years ago where I talk about what is the single best thing that you can buy for your swimming pool. Like people always ask me, you know, okay, great. I thanks for the advice. Hey, what's your opinion? What should I buy? What are you know the things that I are must have items for swimming pools? And at the time, and something I still still agree with really, is I said variable speed swimming pool pumps. When you start crunching the numbers and seeing how much money you save with a variable speed pump, it is preposterous how much it saves you. You cannot possibly argue that it's not worth it. However, here's something that I thought of recently. If you got a variable speed pump and you just did this, great, okay, awesome, I love it. I'm just gonna turn it on full speed and leave it like that forever. Yay, I'm so happy I got a variable speed pump. The, the savings are pouring in. If you do that, you're not going to save any money at all. You bought a pump that's three times as much money as the pump that you used to have, and you run it exactly like the pump you used to have. So some people know, they're like, yeah, I get it. Okay, so I'm going to turn down the RPM and bam, that's all I need to do, right? It's more complicated than that. You know, really all along, you haven't been filtering your water properly. This is stuff that you're supposed to calculate, not just say like, oh, I run my pump four hours a day, water's always clear. You need to filter three times the volume of your pool every 24 hours. That's what you're aiming for. And you don't, you can't begin to do that if you are missing an important piece of instrumentation. And that's what this video is about. I used to say that variable speed pumps, single best thing you can buy for your pool. And you know what? It almost is. Almost is. A flow meter is the single best thing that you can buy for your swimming pool. Because you know what? You're going to have to buy that pump. It doesn't matter where you live. You're going to be forced to buy a variable speed pump. But nobody's going to force you to learn how to use it and make sure that you get your money or your return on investment. And so that's why I'm changing that, that video, in my opinion. The very best thing that you can get for your swimming pool is a flow meter so that you can monitor the amount of flow traveling through your filtration system at any given time so that you can begin the process of calculating your filtration rates so that you can try to achieve three times the volume of your swimming pool through your filtration system every day. If you found this information helpful, please be sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And you can check out my website, swimmingpoolsteve.com.